pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Central. I'm Carly. I am Farrell. Today is Wednesday, September 26th, and this is a D Day. We are full swing into homecoming week, so hopefully you're wearing pink today. Tomorrow is Senior Citizens Day. Just a reminder that the uh, Powder Puff game has been rescheduled the Friday after our party in the parking lot. This is a closed event only for CCHS students and their parents. Hope to see you all there. GSA will be meeting on Thursday, September 28th at 2 p.m. in student services. New members are always welcome to attend. Attention all junior and seniors that are signed up for the SAT. There will be an informational meeting in D254 this Thursday, September 28th at 1.55. Then, starting next week, Mr. Cross and Ms. Smith will be holding review sessions every Tuesday and Thursday. Hope to see you there. SAD will have meeting Tuesday, October uh, 2nd, right after school in room C127. Join us and earn community service as we prepare for Red Ribbon Week. It is fall and along with that comes the opportunity to help beautify Union Road before winter sets in. The CCTA will be doing the semi-annual cleanup of Union Road on October 7th. Students interested in helping out and or earning volunteer hours should see Mr. Orgak in D259. Wear old clothes, bring a pair of work gloves, and be ready to stroll down Union Road. Any questions, email or see Mr. Orgak and get some of those service hours out the way. For a very limited time, the 2023-2024 yearbook is available for pre-order for a low price of $65. The price will increase Friday. Order now. The price rises over the course of the year and is $90 if you wait until June. Personalized covers come with four free icons, but only until September 29th. <laughs> Happy birthday to Zaria Brodus and Ian Lupakis. Have a wonderful birthday. Good morning, Central. I'm Michelle. I'm Lamont. Here with your Warriors Sports Report. The Lady Warriors swim team fought a tough battle against Star Point on Monday night, but came up short. However, Abby Similek made a best time in the 50 free. Hannah Molinari's Sneed dropped two seconds on her 100 backstroke. And Serenity Murphy also made a best time dropping seconds on her 100 freestyle. Our next meet is our senior meet home against Amherst. Stop out and support the team at 5 p.m. It's Spirit Week, so please come out and support your Warriors at home this week. Wednesday, girls volleyball plays the Pew at 5 and 6.30. Boys soccer plays Maryville at 6. Finally, on Friday is the Potter Puff game after the party in the parking lot. Hope to see you in the stands, Warriors. Happy Wednesday, Warriors. Go Warriors! Hey,